Churro, he really is gone forever. Are you all right? You by yourself? I am. Are you by yourself too? There's someone coming. Can you stay and talk till then? Making a child wait all by herself. Of course. We'll stay here until they come get you. Where's your friends? Well, I have some at school. No, silly. I'm not talking about them. I mean your friend that told you to update the decode. Huh? Hmm? What's wrong? You look like a scared kitten. Hold it right there. Who are you? Who ordered you to update the decode? Decode? Do you mean the Dimos code? Yep. I know it wasn't you. Tell me who it was. It was a cat. Huh? A fluffy black cat with a white-tipped tail. So you caught her? Renya Goto. You're late, Goto-kun. Did you know? Do you understand what you did to me? I sealed your powers as a witch. To fight the kaiju. That's what I was told. Witches and cats. Interesting story. I thought you'd be able to see through the ruse a bit more. Wanna know what you shot him with? It was nanomachines. They added code to the ones already in their bodies. The code expands the kaiju's capabilities. How strong it will allow them to become. We have no way of knowing. I can't be. The one behind all this. The one who manipulated you. It seems they are trying to take control of the decode. If they succeed, they will also have control of the Sentinel dock in the factory. In other words, we lose all our means of defense. Are you aware of who that cat is? No. That seems bad. He must have known this would happen. He had a plan. That's why he used the girl, so we couldn't trace it back to him. But that very cleverness is what proves it was him. So, who is he? No one you'd have heard of. He's a criminal from the future. A criminal? From the very beginning, it was all lies. I won't forgive him. Not ever. There you are. About time you got back. You lied to me. About everything. You seem mad. But I haven't lied to you. You're a criminal from the future. I know you are. All that about ancient civilizations and curses. You've been playing me for a fool the whole time! I haven't been lying. There is an ancient civilization. This may look like the 20th century, but it's not. Humanity actually died out in the 22nd century. It's been millions of years since then. So, in reality, the 22nd century is an ancient civilization. So you're saying... This isn't the real world? No, more lies! You convinced me to shoot my friends with this thing! And now you're in control of the Kaiju and the Sentinels! 
Was that your goal all along? To end humanity? I've already told you. This is a game. I'm only making preparations. A game where our lives are on the line? Not if things go the way I want them to. I can get you all out of here alive. <laughs> you shot me. Seriously? You've really turned into a dangerous girl. Although I guess that is my doing. Whose memories are in Jura? Ah, oh, right. That. Those are my memories, actually. <sighs> it's not my fault, though. You really think I'd believe your lies again? No, I don't imagine you would. You were using Juro, too, weren't you? It was not my intention. But in the end, that is what happened. You need to give up on trying to bring him back. By the way, I forgot to mention, you're the final witch. But you don't have to meet the same fate as the rest of them. Wait, what? Where is he? To actually shoot yourself like that, it must have really been driving you mad. But don't worry. If you don't fight, there's no way you'll survive. You did what had to be done. I want to apologize about his memories. There were things that happened I didn't expect. But none of that matters to you. There's no excuse. I boasted about how I could bring him back. It may seem like I tricked you, but I really did all that I could. I had no ill intent. Well, there may be a little. I just wanted him to become the Juro of my world. I wanted to control his feelings of love. Almost like a parent to their child. I wanted my desires to become his own. I guess I hesitated once I saw the depth of your feelings. There was still some human left in me, after all. You might not believe me, but I really have become fond of you. Megumi Yakushiji. The days we spent together were surprisingly fun. It gave me an odd feeling. As if I were on holiday with a cheeky daughter. You left me some nice memories. And now it's up to all of you. I've made all the preparations I could. Since I was unable to hold up my end of our contract, this is goodbye. If our plan succeeds, 
I want you to live out the rest of your life with Juro. Take care, and good luck. Yakushiji. Juro. What happened? Uh. Did you shoot yourself in the stomach with that gun? Please, wait. Just hear me out. Ever since I last saw you, I've been thinking about the dreams I had. None of that matters now. I dream of myself inside the Sentinel. I've seen it over and over. I fight in the Sentinel. Taking down Kaiju after Kaiju. Struggling in pain. Fighting like some kind of possessed demon. Right arm destroyed. Damage immense. Pilot must cease control. I still have my left arm. Abnormality detected in life support. Emergency release of Sentinel pilot. Initiating. No! Cancel release! I'll continue to pilot. Override command. I won't let them destroy Megumi City. This place is home to all our memories. Life support limit reached. Emergency release procedure. Initiating. No! Cancel the release! I'm not done yet. The more I thought about it, the clearer it became. The only one who has experience piloting Sentinels is the Juro Izumi you know. These are his memories. <sighs> In battle, he was always calling out someone's name. I didn't realize it at first, but... I know it now. It was your name. He was fighting for you. Juro... I'm not... I'm not Juro Izumi anymore. But my feelings are the same. Maybe it's because of his memories. But even so, none of that matters to me now. Because I... well... I love you. My feelings for you are just as strong and true as Izumi's. Do you not feel the same way? Thank you, but... Fluffy really was trying. Just like he said. He was trying to get his memories back. What do I... It's true that uh, I'm not... I may not be as strong as him. But I don't care. I will protect you. With everything that I have. No. <laughs> I'll never let you fight on your own again. I'll fight to protect you too, Juro. I wouldn't have it any other way. Does that mean... Yakushiji? For you, Fluffy. <laughs>